you just chunk of the shark pit, tongue in the garbage, talking that shit, no adrenaline blockage, blood caked on my pitchfork, American Gothic, my love slave house train, no shit on the carpet, hit her nose with the newspaper, get the loop later, killer just for necro, call me too late. Hello everyone, horror author Aaron Beauregard here, and I'm very excited to talk to you today. Uh, thank you for joining me on Maggot Mail, and we're going to talk about the release of my new book, The Cuck, today, that is available on Amazon in ebook and paperback formats. Um, the ebook is $3.50, and the paperback is $10.99. If you guys are holding out for the bundle with like you know the different magnet merch and whatnot you know the bookmark and everything and the pins um those should be up on my website abhorror.com in about i would say two weeks maybe give or take um but i'm gonna be posting i'm gonna send out a specific maggot mail email to alert all of you that are dedicated on the list and also, I'll put some stuff up on social media so that everybody knows when it go, when the 100 bundles are going to go live. So, thanks to everybody who pre-ordered the ebook already. I really hope you enjoy it. It's uh, I think it's one of my creepiest stories so far. And it's definitely a setup uh, for more to come with this story. I can just tell that the story's not done yet. And um, there's going to be, there's there's other ideas that I have, I guess, is the best way to say it for it. So if you enjoy it, if you enjoy the cuck, um, look forward because there's going to be more in that universe to be released. Now, as far as other updates, I want to say July 10th at Buttonwoods Brewery in Cranston, I'm going to be there uh, doing a signing. So that'll be pretty awesome. You can um, come stop by, have a beer. There's going to be all kinds of weirdos there. It's called the Dark Arts Festival. Uh, it's from, it's on that Sunday, July 10th from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Uh, so there should be good beer. I think there's gonna be like a food truck and all kinds of strange memorabilia and weirdness and horror authors and kind of everything you can imagine for horror freaks like us. So if you get a chance, it's free admission. Definitely stop by. It never costs anything to have a conversation or a laugh. Uh, or if you got something existing that you want to get signed that you haven't had a chance to yet, I'd always do those for free. So um, stop on by. That's Buttonwoods Brewery on July 10th for the Dark Arts Festival. Also, if you guys are, I know a lot of you are probably fans of Chris, uh, Christopher Triana. He's going to be there as well um, with me. So that'll give you an opportunity to get some of his stuff and get some stuff signed from him if you have, if you have a chance you know now as far as like other updates and stuff um i want to remind you guys i got three chat books that are coming out with death's head press that are like little mini you know stories um i just got the covers back they look super cool i can't really share them yet but i think you guys are really going to dig that and then survivors guild with matt shaw we do have that signing in september 8th uh where we're both going to be in new york at the michelangelo hotel signing to anybody who uh did the survivors guild and i'm gonna actually be getting the paperback in later today of it um so i'll be posting that up on social media and you know if it, there's still a few slots left if you guys want to come and meet us in person. Or if you just want the dual signed copy of the paperback, uh, it's not available on Amazon, so there's only gonna be uh, a few of them and probably a con item or something like that. I may put a few in AB Horror, the store as well, but definitely if you want the dual sign with both me and Matt, now would be the time to do it. And as far as other stuff, I would say if you, you know, continue to listen to Written in Red podcast because we've got some really cool guests upcoming. I have a bunch of episodes in the can that I haven't released yet, and we got some really cool people on there. If you recently watched the show, you might have seen we just had, you know, Matt Shaw, Ron Kelly, um, and we got definitely a lot more to come. So 
Check out Written and Bread. That is the Horror Readers Podcast. The Horror Reader and Writers Podcast, excuse me. And then I would say later in the year, I have another project called Playground that I'm going to be releasing. And uh, it's going to be novel length. It's, it's an insane book. Uh, I can't wait to release the cover to kind of give you guys an idea of what it is. Um, but I'm going to wait on that a little bit longer just because I want to finish tightening it up and start getting into the editing process with it. But that will definitely be released this year, Playground. Um, I'm still working on The Rash as well. Um, I believe that that will probably also be released later this year. And then I have one secret project that we're, we're going to be announcing probably within the next month or two. It involves me and two other horror authors that you probably know and love as well. Um, so I'm very excited to announce that. And there's one other thing that's definitely going to be set for this year. That's a, a limited hardcover of one of my prior books that I'm doing um, with brand new artwork and a bonus chapter and a fresh edit. Um, I can't announce what it is yet, but I can just say it's going to be available only at abhorror.com exclusively. Um, and it is, <laughs> the new artwork is insane. Um, I'm having it printed up through a private printer, um, private press, so that I don't have to deal with any censorship via Amazon. So this book is fucking, you know, the artwork is no boundaries. It's not anything like, you know, where you have to worry about getting censored. So this is something that's directly for the fans. And I'm real excited to talk about it in the future. It's not too, too far away, but I don't want to get ahead of myself for now. I'm just concentrating on getting these cut packages out to everybody. And I really hope you guys enjoy the book. So I just want to say thank you again for your support and allowing me to do this for a living. Uh, it's incredible. I love you guys, and I hope you have an awesome, awesome weekend. Just for necro, call me Tomb Raider, falling like the blue blazer to Lucifer's refuge, fornicating with some mutants that was grown in a test tube in a public restroom. Side of me and shrooms after I climax, the lobotomy resumes. Yeah, the kids so rude, they want to give me the needle. Should have ripped me out my mama's stomach when I was fetal. I'm hitting so many cigs, got a future in chemo, till then I'll be like music's version of Quentin Tarantino.